Well, could you imagine having to pay off your mortgage for the rest of your life? More and more homeowners are facing a situation where their payments no longer cover interest, let alone pay down their loan. CBC Business reporter Philippe de Montigny joins us now with more on all of this. So, Philippe, help explain this phenomenon if you can. What is it? Yeah, so Hillary, if you have a variable rate mortgage with capped payments, fixed payments, well, you'll feel every rate hike there's been in the last year and a half. And uh, what happens with your fixed payment on a variable rate mortgage is that the portion uh, of that monthly payment going to interest also goes up. And if at one point uh, your monthly payment doesn't cover isn't enough to cover all of the interest costs well that's when you fall into what's called negative amortization uh, so that extra interest then goes back into your mortgage balance and your debt actually goes up which is quite the frankly the opposite of what we're doing when we want to pay down our mortgages uh, each month so i spoke to a homeowner in uh, joliette quebec who uh, is worried about falling into that uh, that kind of mortgage trap, if you will. Uh, he worries that another rate hike will push him there. Last month, just as an example, he paid only $23 in principal and more than $1,100 in interest, and his mortgage repayment period nearly doubled from 25 to 47 years. I wasn't happy when I saw that. At first, I thought it was uh, actually a, a mistake from the bank when I saw that, you know. I, I would owe ex more money to the bank and so instead of my uh, instead of paying it off well i'm gonna get just in more in more debt you know if this is already the case for about one in five residential mortgages at three big banks so tell us a little bit more about that yeah so td bmo and cibc have all reported in their third quarter filings that uh, they have uh, about 20 percent negative amortization uh, mortgage loans and so just to size the issue uh, we're talking about 128 billion dollars worth of loans that are now negatively amortizing the three banks tell cbc news that uh, there are a couple of different options that clients have either they can pay a lump sum uh, they can refinance their mortgage or they they can increase their monthly payments but sadly in in this current economic context it's not something it's not an option that everyone can afford it shouldn't be allowed uh, I know that most lenders w in this situation what they do is uh, they increase your payment it's an alarming situation considering the times that we're in right now with the inflation creeping up so now Canada's superintendent of, uh, of uh, financial institutions, yes, it's a long name, uh, the, the Canada's banking regulator says that he uh, plans to crack down on negatively uh, amortizing loans to rein in the risk for lenders and their clients. So uh, those new rules and guidelines will be coming out later this month, Hillary. Okay, Philippe, thank you for this. We appreciate the reporting there. CBC's Philippe de Montigny for us.